everyone, welcome back to our channel, fellow golf enthusiasts. Today, we're delving into the intricate world of golf rules, shedding light on seven scenarios that could potentially catch you off guard. We'll provide you with valuable insights on how to navigate these situations without incurring any penalties or running afoul of the rules you might not be entirely familiar with. Rule number one, trying to find out your competitor's club choice. It's crucial to understand the distinction between what's allowed and what's not. Under the advice rule, rule 10.2, you are prohibited from asking another competitor about their club choice, except for your own partner. However, you can discreetly glance into their bag to deduce the missing club or the one they've put back. Keep in mind, though, you cannot physically handle their equipment, such as moving a head cover, towel, or bag cover to get a better look. Doing so would breach rule 10.2, resulting in the general penalty, a loss of hole in match play or a two-stroke penalty in stroke play. Rule number two, backstopping. This intriguing rule pertains to leaving a ball in place on the putting green that might assist another player if their ball makes contact with it, potentially giving them a more favorable position. In stroke play, if two players decide to leave a ball in place on the putting green to assist one player, both parties would incur a two-stroke penalty under Rule 15.3a. Keep in mind that this rule applies only to shots played from off the green. Striking another ball at rest on the green during a stroke play incurs a two-shot penalty, making it an undesirable risk. Rule number three, sprinkler head on your line on the fringe. Our next situation involves a sprinkler head obstructing your intended path on the fringe. It's essential to note that this isn't an automatic relief scenario under the rules of golf. You're entitled to free relief only if your ball lies on the sprinkler head or if it interferes with your stance or swing area. However, some courses might have a local rule allowing relief if your ball lies within two club lengths of a sprinkler head on your line, which is also within two club lengths of the putting green. Always check the scorecard or notice board for such local rules, as they may vary. Rule number four, no penalty if your ball accidentally hits you. This rule has seen a gradual reduction in penalties. In 2007, it was two shots, reduced to one shot in 2008, and as of 2019, there's no penalty at all. So, don't let anyone misinform you about a penalty if your ball accidentally makes contact with you. Rule number five, accidental movement of your ball. Even if your ball moves at rest, whether accidentally or not, there's still a penalty. Some golfers mistakenly believe there's no penalty for accidentally moving the ball, especially in the general area. However, exceptions exist, such as no penalty for accidental movement of your ball on the putting green or during the search for your ball. Additionally, there's no penalty if you accidentally nudge your ball off a tee peg in the teeing area. But in the general area, bunkers, or penalty areas, there's still a one-stroke penalty for moving your ball at rest, even if it's accidental. Remember to replace it to its original position to avoid a two-shot penalty for playing from the wrong place. Rule number six, finishing off in match play. If you find yourself two and a half feet from the hole and your opponent doesn't concede the putt, you can't simply tap it in, as you would in stroke play. In match play, this would be considered playing out of order. Although there's no penalty for this breach, your opponent could request a replay of the stroke if you make the putt without their consent. Rule number seven, identifying your ball. When you're unsure if a ball you found is yours and want to check, many golfers instinctively pick it up without marking its position first. However, it's crucial to remember that you must always mark the ball's position before lifting it to identify it, even though you no longer need someone else to observe the lifting process. Failure to do so results in a penalty stroke. And there you have it, golfers, seven crucial rule scenarios to keep in mind for a smoother, more enjoyable game on the greens in 2023. Understanding these rules can save you from unnecessary penalties and keep your golf game on the right course. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more golf tips and insights. Until next time, happy golfing.